Long ago, when my dad was a young man, and I'm an old woman now, he had some young coon dogs, and he decided to take them out to a woods on the other side of the mountain to try them out and uh, see if they could tree a coon or whatever. And um, when he went out, it started to rain. And he had a lantern, and they carried lanterns in those days. And um, he walked on, and it rained harder. And uh, he thought, well, maybe he better turn back. But he thought he'd travel a little farther, see if he could hear the dogs. So he came to an old house. And it was an old log cabin. It was dark. So he took his light and went inside. And and looked around and there was a fireplace and some old wood and kindling had been left a long time ago so he put some in the fireplace and struck a match thought he'd wait for the dogs and warm up a little bit and dry his coat so he took his coat off and, and put it up to dry and took his boots off to sit down by the fire and it was pretty nice and warm and he heard a noise behind him. And he looked and across the room there was an old staircase that went up to the second story. And down came a big old black cat. And um, he came over and sat down on the other side of the fireplace from him and licked its paws and sat there a minute. And uh, it was probably about three feet tall when he sat down. And, uh, Suddenly the cat said, Nobody here but me and you tonight, is there? And he said, Wait till I get my boots and coat, and there won't be anybody here but you. 